Dear students, you have to complete 60 working days internship in order to be able to graduate. You may start your first internship when you complete your fourth semester. There are two different categories of internship, which are construction and office internships. It is recommended you to start the internship with the office category for the first internship. Students have to complete both of them and at least 20 working days internship must be completed for each of them. You have to do the internships in the summer holiday or winter break. After completing your internship, you have to enroll the internship course. It means if you do your internship on summer, you have to enroll the internship course on the following fall semester. There is also a third option called school internship, which is not compulsory. School internship, which is max for 20 days, includes summer and winter school events. You may find all the information and the related documents about the internship from the its learning platform. There are some forms that you have to fill before starting your internship. You may find the required forms under the resources tab, its learning. These forms are listed as application form, petition, compulsory form, declaration and commitment, copy of identification, one photograph, Residence Certification Follow the steps for finding the forms. Choose the All Courses in the ITS Learning Platform. Choose Architecture Internship or Interior Architecture Internship. Choose Resources. You can see all forms and construction site internship report and office internship report. You must send all the documents, except the evaluation form, to the following addressees on the screen at least five days before starting the internship. Proceed by following the instructions on the screen in the documentation processes related to the internship. Mrs. Maiden will send your insurance form to you before starting the internship. And you have to upload that form to insurance form upload folder, it's learning. After starting the internship, you have to follow these steps. You have to use its learning to write your internship daily reports. Select the internship report tab and press continue test review button. You have to write a report for each day and upload some visual materials such as drawings, photographs, etc. You have the chance to pause your writing with the button of pause test review and you may continue whenever you want. When you press the save test review, you will save the report and send it to us for evaluation. The Save Test Review button will show up at the 40th day. You have to press the Save button at the end of 40th day to complete the process. You have to take the evaluation form from the company at the end of your internship. That form has to be filled and signed by the person who is responsible from the firm slash company. And you have to send that form to the internship instructor when she slash he announces the related date. Check again. Please. Don't forget to upload insurance form. Read all the instructions carefully. Fill the application form correctly. Handwriting is not acceptable for application form. Fill it digitally. The form must be prepared with wet signature and official stamp. If you don't submit on time your internship will not be accepted. After writing your internship, don't forget to send it to internship instructor. The send button will be seen on the 40th day.